Hi, Bananas. Good to see you again. Hi, Miss Rachel. Hey, I was looking at my calendar and I noticed that today is Earth Day. So I wanted to come up with an activity for you. And this is an activity that helps us not only appreciate the Earth, but being outside in nature and being grateful for what we find there are all things that help us stay healthy. Not only physically healthy, but emotionally healthy too. You ready to see what your game is? Yeah, tell me about my game. Okay, so this is what I have for you to do. It's called an Earth Day Gratitude Hunt. It's kind of like a scavenger hunt. So I'm gonna tell you 10 things to find outside and then you're gonna go outside and find them, okay? Ooh, that sounds like fun. Wait, here, I'm gonna go get my binoculars. Look, here they are. See? My sister and I made them using cardboard and tape. You ready? I'm ready to go. Let's do it. Number one, find something that's bigger than you. And then tell me three words to describe it and tell me how it makes you feel. Hey, I found a tree. Wanna see? See? There's the tree. Let's go check it out. I'm supposed to tell you three things about my tree. My tree is bumpy. My tree is really big. And my tree is really fun. Because I'm a monkey and I get to swing. It makes me feel so happy. You want to see? Number two, find something smaller than you. Again, tell me three words to describe it and how it makes you feel. I'm supposed to find something smaller than me now. I found this white truck. It's bumpy and it has shiny parts in the sun and, and it's white and it makes me feel magical because I think it's a magic rock. Number three, go hunting for an animal. It could be a big animal or a little animal. And tell me what you like about that animal. Now, I'm gonna be looking for an animal. I found a little itty bitty ant bug. I like how fast they can crawl. Cool. Get back here, little ant. Number four. Find a living plant somewhere. Just something that looks cool to you. And then draw a picture of it. Try to pay really close attention to the colors that are on it and the details, like how many leaves it has. I found this little green plant. Right there, going out of the log. I'm starting my picture with brown for the log. Round and round for the log. Here's the picture I made of my plant. It had a little bit of purple and yellow in the green leaves. That was pretty cool. Number five, find something that's beautiful, beautiful to you. Tell me what's beautiful about it. I found this beautiful yellow flower. My mommy doesn't like them and daddy doesn't like them either, but I think they're beautiful. Look how bright and happy it is. Number six, find something that's broken or maybe bent and try to find a new way to use it. I found some sticks and stuff that broke off from my tree. I used them to make this funny face. Oh, now my funny face is sad. 
Ooh, he's grumpy now. Number seven, find something outside that reminds you of someone you love. And tell me about it. Hey, check it out. I found this blue string on the ground. It reminds me of my best friend, Shatters. His favorite color is blue. Number eight, find something that smells outside. What is it like when you smell it? Does it remind you of anything? Ooh, look at that. There's a rock in the puddle on the sidewalk. I'm gonna smell that. Mmm, I love the smell of wet rocks after the rain. It reminds me of going on picnics in the mountains. Number nine, listen for Five different sounds outside. It's amazing what you hear when you think that it's quiet. Mom said that I could come outside to listen to the sound of the rain on my umbrella. Listen to it. It's all done raining now, so I can finish listening for sounds. I like the sounds of the wind chimes. Look over there. I hear birds singing and I see one over on the ground. It looks like it's got a mouthful of grass. Silly birdie. Maybe it's gonna make a nest. Cool. I like the sound my feet make in the leaves. Listen. Crunchy crunch. When I'm real quiet, I can even hear the sound of my breath. Lastly, number 10, find something that you're going to keep with you all day. Something that will remind you of all the things that our incredible earth has to be grateful for. I'm going to keep my white magic rock to remind me of my time outside today. I'm going to do magic all day. Now, I'm going to disappear. Abracadabra! Okay, bye bananas. Have fun with your magic rock. And all of you at home, I challenge you to go on the scavenger hunt too and learn all the ways that being outside can help you better your health. Bye, happy Earth Day.